And good morning. Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up the A3 launcher for the, um, a lot of the mods that <clears throat> everybody uses in Arma 3. So uh, let's get started. First of all, you're going to um, open up your whatever browser that you use, whether it be Chrome, Internet Explorer, or Firefox. Second of all, you're going to type in a3launcher.com. Um, this is the A3 launcher. Uh, a lot of people use the CCG launcher, but um, I feel like the A3 launcher is a little bit easier to work with. While you can, you know, the mods anyways <clears throat> so right here you're gonna click download uh, you're gonna put it wherever you want to put it um, uh, we'll just put it where I usually put everything else we'll replace it for this purpose <clears throat> alright once that it's finished downloading you click it Uh, we're gonna hit run next pick and choose where you want to place it um, I placed it in uh, my game uh, my game folder that I usually run all my stuff in uh, you know you'll go through the process of once it installs you get finished it'll uh, put you a shortcut here this is what it'll look like so your first time using it you'll double click on it it'll tell you that some of your settings can't find Arma 3 whatever um, or it might say that it needs to be updated just click OK hit update next off you're gonna hit settings because this will be the first thing you have to do to in order before you download any mod whatsoever uh, you'll have to pick the link the path to your Arma 3 so first off your mods are gonna download to your wherever your Arma 3 folder is you want it to be precisely inside your Arma 3 folder so you would go to Steam let's see Steam Steam Apps Common and then your Arma 3 folder and then you'll double click on your Arma 3 folder and then just place it inside your Arma 3 folder you can even make a new folder A3 launcher um, you'll hit OK at that point uh, then you'll come down here to the Arma 3 path that way it tells it um, that it it knows to look for your Arma 3 folder also um, so that way whenever the game is loading its add-ons it can find the Arma 3 and you know start loading the game from there so same deal you would just go to Steam Apps or Steam, Steam Apps, Common and then your Arma 3 folder just highlight it hit OK um, after that you can save it if it asks you you can verify it sometimes you might want to do that to make sure that it, it links up properly oh, that was my bad I mean to close it on you alright second off um, once you get that set up you will want to hit mods you will need the all in Arma terrain pack to run any of I shouldn't say any of most of all your um, modded games in Arma will need this terrain pack this is the biggest one um, so I would suggest if you do not have fast internet um, do this at night while you're asleep or first thing in the morning if you're leaving to go somewhere um, just it'll be download just like this box it will be right here you just click download and it'll start download so you need an all-in Arma terrain pack uh, you will need the E mod, the latest and greatest, downloaded. 
um, you will need also the Epoch latest and greatest downloaded. You will also need Mass Weapons 1.8. And finally, whether you're playing Bornholm, Nemalesk, uh, Panthera, a lot of everybody plays Panthera, you'll have to download also these mods so you can actually get into the map itself um, as far as anything else that is technically it um, yeah anything else it it will automatically sometimes tell you if you don't have the right mod and automatically start downloading it for you if you click OK and then once that happens you can just you could pick the server and it'll tell you that it doesn't have these mods you must download them you'll click OK and then you can open up your mod and it'll show you it'll be in here downloading it'll have a little bar right here to start downloading um, as far as anything that is completely it uh, once you have everything downloaded you'll go back over here there's these little uh, triangles play buttons I call them uh, all you have to do is then click on it. It will start loading your Arma 3 game. And you will be all set. Um, if anything, if y'all need any more information, just let me know and I will uh, definitely get it out there to you, okay? Uh, have a great day.